We ready to record it? Is this thing going? Are we recording? Penny and Halo, she's giving directions to people coming out in the building. I'm you know so we start the show. Look, so look, look, look at that. FaceTiming and everything. Um, <laughs> Penny and Halo is the, is the propaganda, is the, is the rhetoric. That's what we doing tonight. Y'all give it up for the great people in the audience. Y'all give it up for yes. yourselves. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for coming. Woo! I am the host. Oh man, we got some little feedback. I'm the host. I go by the name of Dirt Beats, and I'm here with the Dallas Angels. And uh, somebody's still on the phone. Oh my gosh! I'm trying to get our studio audience up here. Oh my god! I'm, I go by the name you of Dirt Beats. Have a studio audience. I'm and, Mellow. Uh, I'm Ginger. What's up, man? How y'all feeling tonight? I'm feeling good. It's been, a, it's been a little uh, hiatus um, since we've um, since we took a break for the radio, but we're back. Yes. Uh, been doing a lot of things in between time. Uh, me, myself, I've been working on music. Uh, that's what I do. My last name is Beats, you know? So that's what I do. Oh, a little bit of feedback there. Going <laughs> oh, oh. oh, right there, okay. Um, yeah, but um, Ginger, what you been up to? I know you've been up to some things too. Oh man, oh man, I've been out here, let me tell you. Definitely a lot of... Uh, traveling? Doing traveling? A lot, a lot traveling, of modeling? yeah, definitely. Haven't been home. <laughs> Lots of modeling stuff. And uh, yes. Mel and Mel. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? Mello What's up, baby. man? What you been up to? Working. Working. That's what it's yes. about, though. Yes. Trying Working to feed a woman. family. <laughs> most people, that's what most people are trying to do these days. Yes. Uh, clap if you're trying to feed a family. If you're trying to feed yourself, just clap one time. <laughs> that's, what, that's what we're doing. I'm trying to feed myself, too. Um, trying but, to feed um, everybody. Yes. This is a new show, man. You, you know, we've been doing Dallas Angels Radio for almost, uh, almost five years. But this is a new spinoff visual podcast called Henny and Halos being shot right here, downtown Dallas at Don't Tell Supper Club. So this is live, man. If you're not a part of this, make sure you get on board, come through, pull up, because it's, it's, it's great energy in here. What'd you say, people? What'd you say? Hey, yeah. shout out to the audience that came through. Yeah. So we got a lot of things to talk about. Uh, we're going to run down a, a few things um, and uh, current events that's happened over the past course of the last two weeks. And uh, I just want to take a moment to reflect on the Nipsey, Nipsey, hustle, uh, uh, Nipsey hustle effect, you know, because I, yes. I really feel like over the last two weeks, uh, I feel like that, that man's legacy has had a, an effect on a lot of people. What would you say? Major. Yes. Um, it had a big one on me. How would you say? How, mm -hmm. would you say? how would you say it affected you? I mean, it's just, I would say it's a Tupac of our generation, but even then Tupac really didn't do as much. It's like basically everything that Nipsey said he was going to do, he did. He did. Yes, absolutely. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, y'all give it up. Yeah, I've been you listening know, to Nipsey Hustle for I mean, about. he's the only person that went back and bought his own block. Yeah. Know? Yeah, I, you know, I was in the barber shop today. Uh, you know, fresh fade. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay, fresh okay. Uh, but um, and, uh, and 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 it was one of those things where um, it was almost like a kind of controversial because you know somebody in the barber shop was like, "Oh, he ain't pop. He ain't pop." But to me, I feel like my personal uh, opinion is that he had more of an impact, a positive impact on pop. You know what I mean? Um, I really feel like Pac had good ideas when Pac was on camera and talking. He uh, had great ideas. He talked real revolutionary shit. But his music and the whole thug life thing, I think, was actually uh, promoted as propaganda towards the whole culture. Like, the whole thug life thing. I mean, that's really Tupac. Right. Yep. You know? Um, not to say that he didn't have, you know, Brenda has a baby and, you know, um, uh, Dear Mama. I mean, you know, those were great songs. Those were actually some of the last positive songs that I remember that they was actually playing on the radio, I don't think right now you would be able to hear a song uh, called Dear Mama right now on the radio. No. Would, you, would you say? Would well, you, actually, Boys to Men, but that's different. On the radio? Maybe. Uh, uh, <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I mean, Drake, as a rapper. Drake, Drake did a, a Mama tribute song. <laughs> Oh Drake, yeah, well, Drake, Drake did it. Drake did. I mean, but it was. It, well, I don't think it was Song on the radio. Mama, right. It was on the radio. <laughs> but that might have been his grandmother too. I don't really know. He confused me in the song. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know. I just feel like me, my personal opinion. I feel like that um, Nipsey Hussle had um, a larger impact on the culture from a positive, from a positive standpoint uh, versus um, Tupac. Because some of the lessons and some of the stuff that he's talking on camera, I feel like that I'm going to carry that. I be burning sage in my house now. I wasn't. Oh my gosh, yes. 
Every woman has been trying to burn some sage since Lauren London announced that. I don't know. I've been burning sage in my crib, man. I don't know. I mean, uh, I think that's positive, right? It's, it's, that's a good thing. Well, it only Google is effective it you if you actually open the windows. You, gotta let it out. you ain't trying to smoke <laughs> There's out the no house stage now. You're just moving the demons around to another room. You I actually need to open have to the open windows. the window so they leave. Oh yes. shit! I ain't open no window. All you're doing is like transferring to another room. <laughs> then you gotta you gotta do something else after you sage. What, what, what is that? Shout out to the wood or something. Ain't it like uh, Pokio or something? What is what? Y'all don't know? No, it's some wood you burn after you burn the sage. Oh, see, y'all aren't even doing it right. Oh, y'all not even doing it right. It's what it sounds like. Sandalwood? Nah, it ain't sandalwood. Okay, you know I do got some wood. I actually 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 got some Oh, okay, so y'all been doing it wrong. Yeah. 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 So you were just burning sage. Yeah, I was just burning sage. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just putting out everything. everything. <laughs> you taught me something. Thank you. Right, live on camera, man. Uh, <laughs> you're right. You, you, know, you, know, hey, too. you, you learned something too. Hey, right? I just learned something. I just learned something. Um, next, man. Um, how, Ginger, how did, it, how did Nipsey, because I know you're more of the younger, younger generation. Y'all always Nipsey? profile me with this younger generation. I mean, I mean, you turn their up. Profile, you're 23. Okay, I, I turn up. I'm 24 <laughs> years old. I'll put that out there. I, I am a 90s baby. Hey, represent. So it, it, we do have a different outlook on things, but it's not. It's not no 2000s type it's shit. Good, girl. Come on now. <laughs> 94, boy. We were still real in 94. Girl. <laughs> you were just born in 94. <laughs> Wait, so uh, anyway. <laughs> the way I feel about Nipsey, I'm going to be absolutely honest. I barely listened to Nipsey Hustle before he died. Wow, really? I ain't even scared to say it. Want to know why? Because there are so many mainstream rappers to listen to. Nipsey Hussle was just never brought to my attention until he died. Wow. So you, you and, I, never... and it's crazy because like it's two people in particular that like when he died, I was like, dang, I know that that's homie's favorite rapper. I didn't even listen to him, but I was like, hey, I just want to let you know your favorite rapper died. And it was like, what? <laughs> what? And I was like, yeah, I'm sorry. Exactly. Like, I don't even listen to him, but now I've heard all his music and I'm like, dang. So what he do you was, think now? He was like, like crazy with the whole like influential on the community and 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 just you know raising the people that you know were in the slums yeah. up to think that they can do be like him like he raised a good example i didn't even know yeah. i didn't even know i, I had mean, no clue about him. for really? the record i think for the statistics i think the statistics state that it was about he employed about forty-one thousand people i believe that's a lot of people man that's a lot nobody of else can nobody else has done that Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oprah. Oprah. Oprah has she, she. She. She on okay. a whole other level. Oh, that yeah. was okay. different. So <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> Nipsey had a, a good a effect as Oprah Winfrey. I think that's a great example. Absolutely. Because Oprah has been very influential in the world, <laughs> and now that Nipsey Hussle has died, it's very obvious that he has been very influential in the world. The world too. Nobody would just have pinpointed it until he died. No. Unfortunately, nobody really gets all that glory and like chill. they deserve and so they pass yeah I, I that's why you that. work so hard while you're alive to leave a legacy when you die so every day nipsey hustle clearly lived up to his legacy definitely he lived in, it out embedded it embedded it it's just like i said um you know i don't want to bring people down and make them sad man but you know i really not. feel like that um we need to really we reflect, should celebrate his yeah, life celebrate his life reflect on his legacy and uh long live the nipsey Long live Nipsey, long live the Nipsey Hustle effect. Hope it continues to push positive vibes towards everybody. Uh, hey, that's what we doing. So we are upstairs live yeah. with Henny and Halos. Yeah. Upstairs <laughs> to the right. He's still giving directions. Right? <laughs> to the right of the club downstairs. There's a set of stairs where you can get upstairs to the Henny and Halos live podcast. Henny, Henny and Halos, we're right here, man. Yeah. Yep. We, we still got some special guests coming through. Shout out to the Throne Group, our special guest tonight. Shout out to our performing artists that's coming through. Little Sick, man. Little hey. Sick is dope. Uh, dope artist, man. I don't know whether he's doper with the guitar or doper with the raps, but y'all gonna get a dose of him too, man. So stay tuned. We're gonna come back with our actual guests right here live on Henny and Halo. We'll be right back. And we're back. And we're right, back. Right, right. I play it. Please stay. Please stay. We need you here. Please. Horn yeah. Halos. Right. Podcast. Real Life Productions. Stop. Real Life Street Stars. Dallas Angels Media. The Throne Group. 
all collaboratively come together. Is that if a word? Collaborative heaven. Collaboratively. I would feel real guilty right now. Collaborating. Collaborative. Just- yeah, this light is, the light is heaven. Ooh, if that was it's Jesus descending. right now, I wouldn't be ready. Ascending <laughs> to the heaven. Uh, um, but we're back, man. And this is our special, special section that we really like to turn it up with our live studio audience. So we have a segment called Men Are From Mars and Women Are From Venus. Or heaven. Or heaven. Nah, yeah. I like heaven. I'm going to say Venus. Heaven. That, no, far, heaven. that far heaven. ass. Wow. Sure. Or maybe even Pluto. Heaven. Definitely <laughs> heavenly. Uh, Definitely heavenly. Can't I mean, live with them. It may feel Can't like heaven, them. but I don't know if y'all uh, from heaven. Um, <laughs> but, but I'm just saying. Y'all like to think y'all are in heaven. Right. I'm just All saying. Right. I'm just saying. Kitchen. But what you got? What you got, man? Ladies first. Well, you know what? Ladies first. It's it's really not fair right now because well we have the DJ of course he's the male mm. but you know I mean can our I can our cameraman host oh, yeah okay. no oh, everybody oh, look man. look we there's, there's more a, women in here than men to men right, right now so, so like, I mean it's just not my like opinion we are gonna get a couple other pe- full opinions full participation I had to from our crowd was teaming up on you full hey, participation he got my back okay okay so who's gonna go first you go you oh you want first ladies first yeah. Ladies first, right? You want us to open doors and shit for y'all? And open open car doors, what? open open door doors, and get it, girl. Tell them what's Come up. On. Okay, so so my question for the men and the women. All right. Who hits it and quits it more? Oh. Men or women? Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get like, on, on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, I'm going to the audience. Hey, they're looking I'm real tight over there. They're looking real tight. Take the microphone. What we got? Talk to um, him. I feel like women hit it and quit it more. Tell us why. Because yes. we don't love these hoes. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. I love that response. Okay. Anybody um, else? Great. Who's next? Anybody else? Who's next? We got any more responses over no. DJ? DJ, you what? Cameraman? DJ? Cameraman? Yeah. No? DJ, oh. cameraman? No? Oh, so none of y'all hit it and quit. Yeah, no. Oh. Oh, okay. oh, so y'all some, yeah. y'all some real niggas in here. Uh, right. You're saying. <laughs> Um, All right. right, right, right. Black men don't cheat. Black That's right. Cheat, right. 2019, Black men don't right. Cheat, right. Man. 2019, right. right. That's y'all goal for 2019. Black, Black men don't cheat. Black women don't cheat. Black women don't cheat. Oh, what you think? What, you, what about you, folks? Black women don't get caught. Who I think hit it, quit it more? Yeah. Okay. Women. So who gets caught more? Women. Men. Yeah. yeah. I, can, I can't. I can't. <laughs> they slippery. Well, I'm a, I'm a, Excuse I'm a, me. Okay, let, let me just, look. Look, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> so you, like, look, let, men get taught, but they get caught because they ain't dumb. That's what I'm just. I'm sorry. That's just fat. men really I mean, do. Slip so up. let me say, let me say something really for the men. Can, can I say something for the men? Say it, dirt. Can I say something for the men? Say it, dirt. Look, listen. Go ahead, dirt. What you got to say? All right, let me let me tell you. Like a nigga gonna always want to hit it at least twice, okay? Two times. At least more. Like look, I'm more. But look, like, listen. Let me, I'm more. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Now I'm speaking truth. Now a nigga gonna always want to hit it at least twice because the second time he has to verify if you was faking or not. You know what I'm saying? Oh wow. <laughs> uh, so ladies, look, let's keep it clear. You get caught on the second time. On the second you time. You really like the difference. Secondly, you don't. He gonna Secondly, find it's out. more of an ego thing. I know with women sometimes y'all may not let them hit it again. Because of equipment, if you can't problems. hit it again, that means it wasn't good the first time. I mean, that's oh, what I'm saying. I'm just exactly. saying. That's so true. Though. I'm just saying because women don't come back to something that wasn't good. They be exactly, like, Ooh, I yeah. did it. I'll she never gonna, do it again. Never. She gonna Sometimes cut communication if that whack. If you hit her with that whack, we'll go back to trash. That's not lying. I've, I've, I've heard. I, trust ladies, me. Ladies, I'm gonna Trash dick don't say, get called back. If they don't got a line up, they gonna line that one sorry dick up. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I've been loose. Yeah, I've, I've heard, I've, bro, I've heard women complain about a nigga. I've heard, I've heard, I heard women complain about a nigga sex game and still, they still be letting them hit. Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm saying. So Look, I don't if you, know. If you pick up the phone at two o'clock in the morning, charity. It don't matter. It don't matter good or not, huh? Oh. I'm rolling with Drake though, Dirk. Drake said, "I just this need to know what that pussy we like." Donated. So one time is fine with me. One, one time is fine with you. <laughs> what Drake said? Shit. I, I don't know, man. No, I, I'm a double dipper. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> I'm a bite the fry and then dip it back in. <laughs> I'm a double dipper, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> you need extra batter, don't you? I mean, I, I can't help it. I can't help it. Uh, okay. Dallas Angels Media 
Real Life Productions, Real Life Street Stars, man. This is Henny Halo's live podcast. We're going to come back with a special guest, and we're going to have some more spicy talk. Men are from Mars, women from Venus. We turn Heaven. it up. Yeah, yeah. Henny and Halo. <laughs> Where the Henny at? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The Henny coming through. That's what we're doing. Oh, yeah. Don't tell Supper Club. Make sure you check us out every Thursday right here, man. Henny and Halos. You see it? You see? That's what we're doing right here. Hey, that's what we're doing. Uh, and, and, and we're here with the, with the general manager. Talk to man. Pick up, pick, pick up the phone, man. Talk to them, man. Tell them about Don't Tell Supper Club and what makes us the jewel in Dallas, Texas right now. <laughs> Man, it's your own little taste of Vegas here in Dallas. You can't make it to Vegas, come on out to Don't Tell Supper Club. We got Vegas style shows every night. The are open Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Popping bottles. Our presentations are bar none, the best in the city. Only place you can see the angels descend from Earth. Hey, you heard it. The only place that you can see the angels. Straight from straight, straight descending to Earth. Um, straight like that. Henny and Halos, man. So, you, like you said, you have live... Um, entertainment. I seen somebody throw some fire. Um, I seen somebody on the rope. Like, talk about the live entertainment, man. I mean, uh, we. I'm lucky. We have uh, great owners. Uh, Avi Adri has been in the business over 30 years. Lavu Aura, Into the Night Management. You'll know about him. But we bring people all over the country from London, Paris, Ibiza, Mexico. Uh, and we've been lucky to have that. So we got uh, entertainment from Cirque du Soleil, fire spinners, contortionists, silk artists. They wear pasties. They look like anything of the day that you can figure out. Uh, we just try to make sure everyone has a good time and do an amazing show every night. Hey, man, and it's, that's dope. It's really dope. Make sure you get down here. Don't tell Supper Club. Shh. Don't tell Supper Club right here in downtown Dallas. 2310? 2310 Main Street? No, sir. It's what is it? 2026 Commerce two, Street. 2026. Yeah, I messed that all up. I don't know how I got that. I don't know. It's okay. You'll it's find, the Hennessy. You'll find us when you see all the Maseratis and Lambos out front. Outside, right outside, man. Don't tell Supper Club right here. The only place where you're going to catch Hennies and Halo is the podcast. So, man, we were talking about men are from Mars, women are from Venus before we left. So, um, it's, I think it's my turn to ask the question for the men, for the actual, for the men. <laughs> Um, so, uh, I feel like uh, who enjoy who enjoy who enjoys the henny. It's <laughs> the henny, huh? It's the henny. Who enjoys sex more, men or women? Women, women, Easy. women, Easy. women. I, I say women. I say women. Scientific study shows women. I mean, for nine months when they get it's pregnant, you gotta women. you gotta carry that baby around and you gotta push a brick out of you know no, where. It's no. You gotta love sex because no. I ain't doing it if I, that no. shit was happening no. to me. No. Real, I, I'd be no. celibate, no. celibate. It's women. I'll give it to us. I'll give it to us. She wants that but one. But I love an opposing woman's. Okay, so opinion. so. I do. Okay. Over ninety percent of women fake an orgasm. Okay. That's not so true. So I would just yes, I, the men enjoy it more. I, I don't think that's true. The men enjoy it more. Seeing y'all happy is enough for us. So you subject yourself <laughs> to pregnancy, and that's some painful shit. Hello, do we subject that's ourselves to pregnancy? That's some painful shit. I've seen the simulator. No, that's we painful. don't subject ourselves. It's called a condom, my friend. I mean, it's called a plan B contraceptive. My friend. It's in a plan I mean, B. So, so this is chance. It's a so this is CVS plan B. No, it's <laughs> called forty nine ninety nine plus abort, tax. Abort, oh, abort, 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 abort mission. Forty nine ninety nine plus tax. I, I don't. I, I think that men think about it more. I think that women actually enjoy it more. What, how do we enjoy it more? Because I mean, like, there's like nine thousand sensory, like sensory motion detectors down there. That's or some if shit. the man I, even hits them. I mean, yeah, I'm just saying, the shit. capability is there. The capability it's, it's is really there. The, May the, I the, the, the strongest Think about how much prep here. time you go in the, before in you go mind, on a date though. with your man, regardless if you're hitting it right. You're going to prep yourself for about three, four hours. You're That's right. Your nails done. That's right. Your makeup done. Say this. You're going to yeah, do your eyelashes, get there, your eyebrows. And I'm going to be like, you know I could have had a V8. You're right. I'm looking good. I'm going to get washed balls. That's it. And then after I do all of that, and it's horrible, I'll be like, I could have had a V8. Okay. I mean, that's why I don't wear makeup or dress up on dates at all. You don't. Smoke a blunt. Brush stinking off. Now I'm a brush your teeth now. 
All the ladies and gentlemen, she curbing all the niggas that walk in front of her tonight because she dressed up. I'm in sweatpants and a t-shirt, baby. You gonna get me how I come. What about, can, can we hear from our audience? Okay. What, what did they say? Oh, we got somebody who wants to. Audience. Wanna, audience. Huh? We audience. Got some? Huh? Take the mic. Audience. Who enjoys sex more, men or women? Men. We need you to speak on the microphone, though. That's somebody can speak. Think. And what's sexuality? We got somebody who got. Sexuality matters. <laughs> whatever, whatever's whatever. Because I think, I think that women on women got more emotional, so they enjoy it. Women on women no, more. no. We don't enjoy it more. Hold on. Say that again, Nikki Jay. We can have multiple opinions on the mic. Yes. We can have multiple opinions on the mic. Sexes enjoy the act the same, yes, the same amount of enjoyment. Because, I mean, if not, it would have been. Going on as long as, come on, that's like, that was the first profession. We said today earlier in the world, come on now. Come on now. <laughs> Men is doing anything they can to get it. Right, to right. So women enjoy it so as right. well. For a while, they couldn't enjoy it when they didn't have as much birth control. It was really, like you said, it was a risk. But now, men you know run everything. We're Plan B's like. and everything, huh? We're free. I, I can dig that. I'm going to still say women. Our cake and eat it too. Hey, I'm going to say women. How can you speak for women, though? Because you're a woman. Because you can. First thing my How are we going to do a poll goes, and the people answer no for the women? Don't go get no girl pregnant. So as a black man, I'm going to tell you this. They teach you real young to bring no babies home, right? That is true. They teach you that? But, but, but you'll also hear a lot of women say they got pregnant, didn't even have an orgasm. So You don't need an I'm orgasm just, to get pregnant. All it takes hey, is a penis. I'm just saying, though, so it's not enjoyable so for you a got, woman. You don't put I'll yourself at risk. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You enjoy it more, right? Yeah. Because, I mean, we're not pushing out no babies. We still drinking and smoking when y'all sitting up at the house waiting on us. Y'all enjoy it more. Y'all enjoy it more. I personally think that men. Which brings me to my next question. What you got? Who cheats more, men or women? Men. Men. Men, I got several cousins. They be watching these bottle service girls. They call me up. Boy, you know, I say, listen, right up Who that chick chick no, over there? They just no. don't get caught. They Christ. They Christ no. fearing people. I, they cheat like a motherfucker. The man. thing is, is that it's a difference, though. <laughs> Men cheat out of convenience. A, whim, a woman cheats if they want to or when they want to or how they feel. Who gets okay. caught more, though? So let's go a little deeper with this, then. What do you guys define as cheating? Uh, a kiss emoji. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. What, what are y'all? Don't be sending them damn emojis. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> you cheating, <What>? man. <laughs> y'all know, no, y'all know, y'all be checking phones, right? <laughs> so the first time you gotta hide well, a text I, message, that's him, cheating. That's not cheating. If I touch him, that's not cheating. You worried, cheating? You worried about the internet. <laughs> You I'm worried I'm, about the internet. I'm, I'm worried about touching the nigga. I mean, it? It, it, each his own. It depends on how crazy the chick so, is. Like, it definitely does. I, hey, I got a friend right now. His wife saw him delete the text okay. message. Okay, okay, but hold on. Back, but hold yeah, on. I really, I really do want to hear what a guy believes is cheating. When a woman's like, you gotta know me, and y'all were just flirting. Do you think that's cheating? Legitimately cheating is entertaining someone that's not the person that you chose. Exactly. That's and a great answer. Like, hey, give it up. Out, hey, out. give it up. Shut up. Uh, Wait, uh, I, have, I have another question. I have another question. Uh, I have another question. Uh, I'm uh, about to say, is your significant uh, other in the room talk. right now? Let Mello <laughs> talk. This is her right. area. No, not. Right. Okay. Okay. Her area. He can't. And I'm single as fuck. Yeah, okay, because you answered that run, real life. I run a like, club, so I would never you, okay, let my significant other be Mello have this one because she is on point. I'm going to let Mello have this. Y'all be quiet and listen to Mello. What you got? I don't have anything. <laughs> oh, oh, no. No. okay. Uh, Henny and Halos live podcast right here, real life productions, man. We still got some more hot topics, some more conversations. I'm your host, Dirt Beat. This is Ginger. That's Mellow. Ricky Bobby. Ricky Bobby, right here, manager of Don't Tell Supper Club, man. So make sure you come down right here, 2026 Main Street. Don't forget it. Hey, come join us on May 24th. Any female that walks through the door, you're going to oh, drink rosé all night on Ricky Bobby. We got a $35 menu, three courses, May 21st, our, May 24th, our first ladies' night. Come join us. May 21st. Hey, right here. He Don't tell Supper Club. Hit any halos. Hey, and, and we here with our guest, our guest artist of the night, the late, the great. 
a little sick. What's up, man? My nigga said the late, the great, like I'm dead, like I'm dead. He's a Hennessy, man. Nigga dead, like I'm dead. Nah, nigga just, nigga just be killing shit, bro. My nigga just be killing shit, man. Nah, he tried to flip this shit. Nah, it's just damn. Nah, it's I'm a, fuck it. Hey, bro. <laughs> it's, so it's, hey, it's all good, but bro, man. Um, talk to the people, man. I know we kind of had some technical, diff uh, technical difficulties earlier, but talk to the people. Tell the people what you've been doing. I know you've been on tour with Life Jennings. I know you've been, been doing some things, man. Just talk to the people. Tell them what you're doing, man. Uh man, can I have one of these lemons? Absolutely. Man. Hey, yeah. I just been chilling, bro. Like, uh, man, I do. I play um, guitar and keyboard, and I rap, and I try to have a, a underlining message about God and positivity in my music. Uh, I play Thank like you. fourteen. Thank hey, you. Man. Thank you. hey, man. Hey, hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, I feel like I'm in church, man. Uh. I play like 14 instruments, you feel me? So That's lit, dang. Yeah. 14. That's a lot of dedication. My, That's real dedication. My nigga play the clarinet, don't you? Type shit, yeah. <laughs> real school with type shit. Yeah. Real shit, man. Real shit. That's what's up, man. Oh, uh, man. So, um, I, right now, like, who's the most influential musician that you say right now? That you mess with right now? Like, as far as, like, living or, like... Just in general, just music that you uh, may get you through the day. Who you listen to to get you through the day? Besides Nip yourself. Nipsey Hussle. Of course. Hey, Nipsey. Hey, of Nipsey. course. That yeah. makes a lot of sense. Nipsey. Very Nipsey. influential. Um, so you said Nipsey Hussle right now. What's your favorite? What's the What's the favorite favorite song on there right now? Favorite song from Nipsey Hussle probably Double Up. But I, yeah, I go, Double Up. I go, I go all the way back to like. I don't, know if, I don't know if niggas like if people remember like Go Long from like yeah, I remember yeah, Go I'm, Long I'm, with Zero. Yeah, that's my shit. Like. Yeah, I've been I've been listening diamonds on my neck. Fact, yeah, you yeah, know yeah, you know yeah. I've been I've been listening to Lipsy yeah. for a while too. It's man. like certain songs I can't listen to because like that nigga in a whole another tax bracket. You feel me? Yeah, so, like, yeah, I yeah. I gotta keep it. I gotta listen to the broke songs. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he also he real my nigga real like, prolific. Yo. Nipsey is truly yeah. educational. Yeah, he's, he's so he's gifted. He's speaking yeah. words that a nigga from the hood would never know about. Yeah. That's right important. Then. Educated. That's so important. Yeah. Where is shit? All right. So I really am dying to know, like, like you having come so far in your music, and, yeah. and in your music career, your artist career, just coming up in this industry, period. What would you tell your younger self? Like, if you were 21... Like if you could picture your twenty one year old self, what would you tell your barely legal self? About Don't yourself? shoot that nah um don't uh wait, don't wait, don't just that. don't make certain decisions. Like don't I'm like For real, I want you to be one hundred. Everybody everybody got like their own issues, you know, but like mine was like anger. I was too angry for nothing, you feel me? Like dry. So like, for the younger boys out here what you have keep it cool career. yeah just keep it cool it's a, it's a level patience yeah and preparation like preparation plus opportunity equals success so like once the opportunity arrives you still got to be prepared so for it so. just just keep it cool my nigga you got it like it's coming obviously yeah, yeah it's coming yeah, yeah. Like that. like that's what's up so this actually is not going to be about music <laughs> outside of music describe yourself Man, I'm just, uh, I mean, what you see is pretty much what you get. Like, it's like controlled chaos, you know? Like, I'm I'm put together, but I'm all over the place. So, it's like... So, an enigma. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, I bet. Yeah. Is that a, an enigma? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What she said, yeah. This is my, this my advisor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. 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 Bad. What? What I'm looking? Oh, hold on. Wait. Not, not more. Or less. like, ah, cause I ain't got no issue like with breaking it down to you. Like, it's not that complex. Like, it just looked like that. You feel me? Like, it, it's like, it's simpler than what you think it is. You just gotta like dig into it. It's like, like math. You feel me? Like, I'm so, yeah, it's like math. It's, Algebra two or some shit. It ain't that hard. <laughs> it's a little hard, but it ain't. You know what I'm saying? But it ain't well, that hard. Algebra two. Yeah. Algebra two. Yeah. Not one, because uh, you know, two, two a little bit hard. Right. Shout out to my nigga Dino. Yeah. So yeah. But yeah. Not just a. I learned a new word today, man. Yeah. Enigma. 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 That's dope. Yeah. 
Word of the day, yeah. <laughs> word of the day is enigma. That is the word of the day. Is that the camera? Can I see me, Jeff? Yeah. Word of the day is enigma. Yeah. Okay, and I have one more what question for you. I'm not an enigma. That's all that matters. What did he say? What? <laughs> he said he died. I, I have one more question. Are you still hoeing or are you retired? Hey, say, so look, so boom. So I'm 26, right? <laughs> For all y'all that want to know, I'm 26. You feel me? So check this out. Look. And then we keep what goes on in the room stays in the room, right? So look, check this out. Until it goes to YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, yes. Okay. Like, me personally, like, I'm a, I'm a, I would, I'm a sapiosexual. You feel me? Like, I don't like, I don't get off just by like, and it's a bunch of pretty women. Like, I like, like, it takes, it take a little bit to kind of get okay. me going, you know what I'm saying? So, and that's hard to find, you feel me, in certain situations. So, with, due to the circumstance, I really, I don't, I don't do no, that shit don't excite me, you feel me? Like, okay. horn, like, I'm trying to get married. I ain't looking for no hoes, like, I'm looking for a wife. Oh, this nigga trying to Look, win. I got some odds. Oh, that nigga oh, got some oh, odds. <laughs> Oh, I got some walls. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, right. Come on now. Right, right, right. Oh. No, square business. Square right, business. Right. Square business. Right, right, right. Square business. I'm really. Right. Ask my guy. Ask my guy. I'm really like, nah, real shit. I really got yeah. a song. I got a well, song. The boy's always gonna. I got a song. Gonna gonna she zoomed up. in on yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a song called yeah, Sapiosexual. Yeah. Like I'm really yeah. like it Sapiosexual is somebody who's mentally stimulated, not right. physically. Yeah. I'm not right. attracted to like right. I'm mentally. So it takes like right. it's not too many women that can really take you there. So right. That's true. due to the circumstance, I mean if it was a lot of intellectual women out here that uh -huh. really stim So I you're twenty six. I'm, I'm twenty six. You're a sapiosexual. Old. I'm a sapiosexual. So you had less than five? And I like long walks on the beach. Hold on now. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, wait, 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 Whoa! <laughs> hey, yo, Scott, is this is this a couple things? Is this hey, yo, it's a couple th I need to open shit. I, just, I can't even say that. Y'all told me to sit down. I got a lemon, and then that was it. I was just she get the. I didn't know what was going on. All right, right. she blessed you, right, right, right. Damn. I'm not a neo. Nah, I don't no. even do. I don't do. I'm more of a. I'm like a gangster, bro. I'm gangster. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. I'm a gangster rapper, you know. But no, nah, I don't I'm not a neo side. Look, I I put it to you like this. Uh-huh. I love hard, you feel me? And I ain't got time to be playing, you feel me? Uh -huh. With uh with nobody like yeah. I really like I be serious as fuck about life itself, so let alone love. Love is life, you know? So mm -hmm. it's like I ain't got no time to be playing. I ain't, ain't going to play with you. Just don't play with me. I'm the guy that gets cheated on. You feel me? Like, look, I got some more. I got some more. Stop it right now, man. Stop it right now, man. Stop it right now, man. Yo, I am the nigga that gets cheated on. Damn. I'm the guy that gets cheated on. I'm Yo, too nice. We've been no. there and I'm we've too done. Nice. We get cheated on all the I'm time too. too. Nice. I know. Look, I look understand. at us. Look at us. But it's different look for a dude. It hurt more we for a dude. It hurts more for a dude. Cause right. I'm a, I'm a Why does it hurt I'm a, more for a guy to get cheated on? I'm gonna set this president right because now. Listen, our, our, because our egos are attached to our dick. Re remember, I said it. Remember, I said it. For look, a man can cheat ten times to a woman one cheat, and it's gonna hurt. Listen, when y'all cheat, it's like some premeditated. Shit, it's the same reason why people go to jail for no, no he ain't even let me finish. He just <laughs> Yeah. Who is this? Why she do that? <laughs> why she do DJ that? Dirty I'm Ray. Just, I'm just no, that is I'm DJ just, Dirty Ray. Why, 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 she, uh, why she do that? Why she who you don't want like, problems? It's a man. It's a man. No, I was just playing. I was just playing. Stay ready, man. You don't want But no, I'm saying like it just hurt when y'all do it. It's premeditated. Like y'all think it out. Y'all are premeditated. And y'all think, nah, niggas just do shit on, on like influx. Like I mean, influx. Y'all are like, premeditated. When y'all text a girl to come over, that's premeditated. More or less, that's like spare the moment. Like, that, no, but, that is. But, I, no, that but, is. But, but I'm not justifying. I'm the nigga to get cheated on. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Right, like, 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 keep it. No, remember the alls. We just all. Is, remember y'all all. That is premeditated. Remember the alls and that shit. That is premeditated. Oh, I'm that guy. I'm still. Uh, <laughs> 
Hey. 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 Y'all give it up. Y'all give it up one time for little sick though. Y'all give it up for little sick. We'll get out. Hey man, I'm about the way, man. Hey man, yeah. I'm not a hoe though. Just let it hey, be known. I'm not a hoe. Cut the music, dude. I'm, not a, I'm not a hoe. No, you good? Look, yeah, man, we we appreciate you. We appreciate you coming through, man. Tell the people again where they can find you. I am. I am. <laughs> L I L S. I mean, this Hennessy is good. S I C K. And I am real sick on all social media, man. I A M L I L S I C K. Thank you, Hey, hey, just like that, man. Henny and Halo, this is our first episode, man. Make sure you tune in next week. Same time, same place. Right here. Y'all got any other words, man? And I am not a hoe. What you got? What you got, Ginger? That's my last one. We finna show y'all a little sick. First performance with Dallas Angels, real life What's three up? stars at Don't Tell Super Club. Hey. Welcome, Lil Sick, live hey. performance. Yes. Hey. 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 hey, what's up? How y'all doing? Y'all all right? Y'all, y'all good? Let me do one hand clap because you can hear me. Can you hear me? One hand clap. Good. Ain't no rhythm going on. What's up? Okay, it's cool. Hey, I'm, I am LaSig. I'm from Fort Worth, Texas, like right down the street. Uh, man, I'm not going to do too much talking. I'm going to just get to it. Uh, follow me at I am LaSig. Somebody told me to spell it too, because it sounds like I A M L I L S I C K. All right, on all social media, okay? That's if you like it. If you don't like it, it's just, you know. All right, then, whatever. Let's go. Yeah. You turn it on a little bit. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. Man. Hey, I take the rabbit in the bin. I'm trying to go from food stamp cards to a million. Rest peace and all my niggas in the city, but niggas be in their feelings, so they will never admit it. Coming to you live from the lowest part of the trenches. Never paying nothing, I'm still going. And I ain't been around, and I know that it's been a minute, but I can stuck my feelings, but now it's back to the business. Tired of wasting my time, now it's time to go get it. Look how the mama did me Please play with my brain Lies to me, play with me Drop a nigga crazy And wonder why I keep sleeping I got moves on it My emotions ain't the reason why I do things Love and respect, I'm only asking for a few things I can't live like worry about what you think Fuck what you think I said, who's swing? My emotions ain't the reason why I do things Love me down, I'm only asking for a few things I can't live like worry about what you think Fuck what you think Hold music in the building. We don't have no limits. See it, I lift your head, man. Trying to give you a little something that's different. Cause everybody around me, they sound like the same nigga. And I ain't never tamed in the same since we was little. Back when we was eating no hot chickens and skittles. Fucking town, Texas, and turn us into some rivers. But Lord, I pray you forgive me. I gotta clean up the city. Niggas claim the bell with the robber shake at your neck. Got a pride for robbing these niggas. I don't respect. Niggas said that he got me enormous. Shit, that's a bad. Well, I ain't just take the tape and be talking under my breath. Say you my partner, but running when it's a problem. Yeah, we gon' do it without him. See, ain't no more excuses. Just do what you gotta do. Ain't yeah, a real nigga, but shit, I got feelings too. I got moves swinging. <laughs> 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 Hello, everybody. 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 Who's swing? My emotions ain't the reason why I do things. You hold me down, I'm only asking for a few things. I mean, it ain't it like we're about what you think? Fuck with you. I see on IG, this 
money be the check. Still selling G's and CDs at the hood store. Had a little problem for cuz, nigga, we good though. Never turn my back on a nigga. Probably should though. Can't get the same in return. It's cool, it's understood though. Cry with you, nigga. By your side with you, nigga. When your brother died, I was ready to ride with you, nigga. I said I'm traumatized, man. Been through a lot of shit. I'm a sad, sex, drugs, and robbery. You don't get paid for being positive. Yeah, I'm back on that little rocker shit. I say I'm traumatized. Been doing a lot of shit. I'm a sad, sex, drugs, and robbery. You don't get paid for being positive. Cause you wanted to. Ain't no wrong for wrong. The hurt won't lead till you let it go. You gotta right your wrong. The sun won't shine till the rain falls down. You gotta get it out the mud. Everybody wanna be somebody, you feel me? But don't nobody give a fuck, you feel me? It's up to you to chase your dream and to do what you're supposed to do. I am a little sick, man. I appreciate y'all and y'all time. I love y'all, that is just, just.